Hello, this project is about white blood cell classification using convolutional neural network. These are the materials we are providing in the project. The demo video, full document that is a fair copy of a final report and the instruction to execute the program. These are the source code and the zeroth review document. Here it is the base paper for the project white blood cell classification and counting using conventional neural network the human body's uh, immune system is very important for maintaining their health and uh, their immune system here uh, bl white blood cells are uh, important features with uh, maintaining the immune system healthier the leukocytes are uh, commonly used uh, known as uh, white blood cells here some of the types of the white blood cells we are we have to classify these uh, white blood cells and they account also important for uh, maintaining the body healthier first of all in this project we have to classify the blood cells based on the data set we got from the internet or some uh, sources from the hospitals after getting the data set of the blood cells we have to classify it using this convolutional neural network before that some of the pre-processing steps and the segmentation process will be applied on the image this is the basic system of the project first of all we give uh, the labels and the training image to the system the first process will be pre-processing that is the image will be pre-processed that, that can be included grayscale conversion and the filtering process the noise removal that is the filtering process and uh, some uh, histogram process also added after the pre-processing the segmentation will be applied and the feature extension also happen for the image the data set we have after that the convolutional neural network will have that uh, model the features will be extracted to the convolutional neural network for uh, creating the model the mo uh, convolutional neural network with its layer will create the model for classification after that in uh, testing phase we give input image from a uh, internet source or any person's uh, blood cell image we got it from the internet or some hospitals the test image will be pre-processed as a same process first will be grayscale conversion and a filtering process will be applied after these steps the segmentation of blood cells by using the some algorithms in MATLAB we can segment the blood cells after that the feature extraction will be happened then the network will be used for comparing the model predict the uh, result with the model and the uh, CNN result from the test image with this result we can classify whether the blood cell we are giving as input is uh, belongs to which type of uh, the blood cell and it will be useful for uh, counting and uh, other processes for uh, uh, finding the illness in the blood and our body too so now we can see the implementation this is a training process in the training process we can have many layers for uh, training this is the model we got from the training output so we can easily use this model with the project this is a simple GUI for the project it can be easily created by using a guide command in the MATLAB command window first we are uh, selecting the image some images will be there the input image is shown here after that 
we have to convert into into the preprocessing step first the uh, noise will be added to the image this uh, additional adding of noise will be uh, thoroughly uh, eliminated using the filtering process for removing the minute noises present in the image we are uh, extra adding the noise to the image then uh, applying a filtering process for uh, clearly filtering the image we can uh, see the difference and the segmentation process will be applied for segmenting the blood cells this ca we, we can uh, see the differences the transform technique will include the coloring process and some image processing uh, techniques will be applied on the image we can see the final te uh, segmented textured image these are some defected cells now we can classify the blood cell using convolutional neural network the result is shown here by this way we can classify the blood cells for identifying the defects or some uh, types of uh, blood cells in which we have the defects.